Okay, I'm recording. Hopefully. I just spent 20 minutes filming this video and uh, I wasn't recording. New BMX problems. Well, uh, this is the 2018 uh, Fit by Co. Austin Augie Signature BMX uh, 20.5 top tube. 20.50, however you want to say it. So, uh, yeah, I'm a newbie BMXer. I mean, I'm not, like, bad, but I'm not, like, good at all. I'm actually kind of trash, but I'm not, like, Mom, watch this dope bunny hop. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm not like that. Um, of course, the sun comes out now. Uh, so, let's just get into this. So, uh, the bike's very, very lightweight. I'm a big fan of it, like, straight up. It's such a nice, well-put-together bike. Um, so really quickly, I'm, I'm going to go over some, some parts of the bike. Uh, so let's go ahead and just start from the front and make our way to the back, to the big booty. Nice looking big... What the f Tires back there, okay, I, I'm, I'm being weird now, alright. Let's get right into this. So, uh, so the rims, the wheels, the rims, however you want to know, whatever. Durable. Super, super, super lightweight and very durable. Um, that's most of this bike, that's what I'm going to say for most of these parts, are very, very lightweight and durable. I'm sorry if I'm sniffling, it was 20 degrees yesterday and now it's 66, I think you can kind of understand why. Uh, <laughs> that's Charlotte for you. Um, so, uh, so, the, so the wheels, I'll, I'll start with the back wheels and tires. So, uh, they have taken beatings. I have taken it to a college campus, uh, called UNCC, and, uh, I was doing some uh, firecrackering on some of their stairs and it was a 10 into a flat 10 flat 10 uh, so it was 10 stairs flat 10 stairs flat 10 stairs uh, so I went down the 10 flat down the 10 uh, flat but I had so much speed that I jumped or I, I you know I just rode over the next set of, of, of you know, it probably wasn't 10 it was probably like 7 so 7 flat okay yeah, you, you get the point shut up kid okay anyways uh, so, so I rode down flat, rode down flat, but I had so much speed that I just rode right over the next set. No, it was probably 10. It was 10. So, so I rode over the next stairs and my back wheel cased the crap out of the last stair and the rim sounded like it just freaking broke in half and all my sprockets were just, or not sprockets, spokes, all my spokes just went and it just was horrible. And I thought I broke the bike, and I was about to like throw it in a river and just like never see it again. I mean, that's a pretty, pretty uh, expensive river throw right there. You know, 550 bucks, or 500 bucks, around there. But uh, it was okay. I literally got I got the bike, looked at it. There wasn't a bend. There wasn't it. It didn't make it. Uh, it didn't untrue it to where it was super wobbly. There was nothing wrong with it. I guess it was just breaking. The spokes were just adjusting. Um, but uh, I, I've cased I've cased a lot of stuff. Definitely, I've cased the Euro Gap over there. Uh, I, I, I've cased flying out. I've cased so much stuff, and these rims have held up. And the hell I put it through in the past few weeks. Um, so let's move on from that. So to, let's go to tires. Tires are the uh, the gray with black wall. I'm a big fan of that. Um, I have had these tires on my 2017 Dugan 1. I bought that used for like 100 bucks uh, with some Aaron Ross parts on it, uh, Odyssey. And uh, I had the gum tires, the, the same style of gum tires, that's the color of them. And uh, they, they held up pretty good. The problem is that they worn down super, super easily. Uh, they, they wore down ridiculously easily. Like it, it was crazy. But they, they, they're still on my bike. They're still perfectly fine. Uh, my back tire has, it, it's not flat yet. It's still got about, it's probably about halfway through and I've had it for six months. Um, but if you take care of your tires, they'll definitely do what they need to do. Um, but I'm a big fan of them. They grip when you need them to. Um, they just go, it's super hard to get these things to slide out and just slip. Uh, there's not really much I can say about the forks other than the, like I've said for everything on this bike lightweight and durable um, The clamp and the, the stem or clamp or whatever you want to call it that uh, That's definitely uh, it, it's really good. It hasn't adjusted at all um, We'll go to the bars too. So with the bars uh, Whenever I first got the bike just like with any new BMX It's gonna start slipping because it's not broken in yet it hasn't rubbed off the paint and the clear coat or whatever that's under the clamp it's not metal on metal yet. We have a new BMX coming. So uh, very, very good, good, amazing 
uh, clamp and bars, but I had to get a rock whenever I just got this bike and literally scrape off the paint because I was here and I was like, I'm not going home and trying to break in this bike. I'm, I'm going to ride it now. So I got a rock and scraped off the paint and man, that was not fun. Um, so that was very good. The grips, very, very comfortable. Definitely very, very comfortable. Uh, they don't wear, or they don't really wear easy. They don't tear. Um, bar ends are very, very good uh, with everything. Just super, super good. Everything on this bike is so durable and it will not tear. Frame gets very dirty easy, of course. It's a freaking chrome copper, but uh, it's, it's so amazing. The color combo on this bike is very good. Uh, I, I would recommend polishing the bike if it's super, super dirty. Um, I haven't done that yet. But I took the brakes off, the brakes were black. Uh, I didn't want any streaks on my back wheel, so I just took the brakes off and I ride brakeless anyways. So, um, you know, I still want streaks on the back uh, rim before I, throw, you know, it, it just looks cooler, not cooler, it looks better with the, when there's not streaks around your, your rim, you know. Um, pedals, definitely take the reflectors off. I forgot to do that. I've taken them off once, but I put them back on to get the bike serviced, and I'll tell you why in a second. So, they are Odyssey, I forgot what they are, they're Odyssey pedals, I forgot what kind of, you know, what actual pedals that they are. Uh, but I uh, took the reflectors off, it definitely do that, because it, it, it looks horrible with the reflectors, I'm going to be honest. The cranks, the cranks are very, very, uh, they're they're more shorter than, than, than most cranks, I forgot what size they are. Uh, but, uh, super, super dope, uh, they're the centered fit cranks. Uh, with a matte black finish. It looks like a metallic or matte black finish. It looks like a, a, a metallic. Same thing with the sprocket. It's the fit sprocket. Super dope. Uh, highly recommend copping those. You got the gold chain right here. That's just like, my god. I've gotten so many compliments on that thing in the past week that I've ever gotten. Ever. Uh, it's a very, very good touch that fit added with the Augie signature along with uh, the back logo on the seat, on the, the, tri the tripod seat. The fit logo on the back is also gold. I've gotten more compliments on that in the past week than I've gotten on any of my other bikes ever with any parts. Uh, so that was a very good touch. It's a durable KMC chain, of course. Always good KMC. But the hub has something wrong with it. There's something loose, a metal bearing. Something is loose and it sounds like the bike is about to explode and it sucks. I hate it so much. I have to go get that serviced soon, um, but uh, seems like seems like it, it's it's holding up. Nothing's breaking yet. Uh, the tripod seat stitching is very very well done. It's very comfortable. Um, if you take a hard landing on it, you're really not gonna feel anything. Uh, it's a really nice seat. I recommend going tripod seats uh, style. They're very very good. Uh, the color is very good on the seat. I think the seat and the tires matching and the bar is a very good touch with the bike. But, uh, yeah, so that's the 2018 Augie Signature. It's a very good bike. Uh, I highly recommend getting it. Uh, they're sold out for a month, I believe, until February, like the second week of February is when they're getting new stock in and they're shipping them out because they sold out. My recording cut out on me. That's all right. The guy behind me took a slam. Not sure if I got that. He took a pretty big slam. Uh, next or behind me because it's so wet here. I'm not sure if I got that on video, but my recording stops anyways It's the 2018 fit highly recommend getting it. Uh, the, it's the Augie City actually I'm not, I'm not just 2018 uh, fit uh, They're sold out of stock for about a month. Uh, they should be getting more uh, But I highly recommend getting this bike the looks just the performance of the bike. It's so good um, But uh, I'll make more how-to videos on more BMX stuff here soon uh, whenever it dries up and maybe it gets a little bit more warmer not than now because it's actually kind of hot right now um, and it's freaking like January like something January it's January okay uh, but anyways I'll uh, see you guys next time peace out